in this video I want to show you how to set up your network but from the the printer side so we've already done a video which shows you how to set it up on Versaworks and I just wanted to show you where to find it actually on the printer itself so it's really easy um, this is an LEF2 200 but we can do this on all of the uh, the Rolands it's the same place um, so all we need to do is at the moment I've, I've got no material obviously set up um, but all we need to do is press our menu button we go down and then we've got system info I'm going to use my right key to go into system info first one we've got is model which just shows us the model of our machine next one is a serial number obviously shows us the serial number of this machine ink will show us our, our ink so what type of ink we have so this has got eco uv4 next one down is firmware and then we've got network so network is where we're going to set our IP address and also our subnet mask as well. So we're going to press our right key. I've got IP address as the first one that comes up. I'm going to go into that and that, that is the IP address that I've got set up at the moment. To change it, I'm going to press my right key. You can see we've got a little arrow there, right hand key. You can see it puts a tiny little dot underneath my uh, two. So using my arrow keys, I'm going to go up and down and that will change the whole number. So if you press and hold it will go up a lot quicker, then I can go across using my right key to take me to the next bit, and then across, across again, and then press enter when I've confirmed that. Press my left hand key will now bring me back into my network menu. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go down, I'm going to go to subnet mask, and this one's really important. You'll see where your subnet mask is on your computer. Um, if it's a 192 IP address, it will normally be three lots of the uh, 255. Um, then if I press my left key, that will bring me back out of that, and press my left key again, and then left key again. Left key again will then bring me back to whatever was on the first screen. So. It will sometimes say now processing. You want to let it do all that processing before you go over to your computer and start trying to uh, put that new IP address in. But with IP addresses, they do change, so you may have to change this. You may have to uh, play about with those last few numbers. But um, that is basically where you find your IP address on any Roland printer that uses a network.